Hi and welcome back to Live and Breathe Horses and we're carrying on with these wonderful stories from this beautiful book More Than a Horseman which is a collection of stories about Tom Dorrance. Today's story is from Bob Blackwell. Tom taught me many things when I was around him and quite a few when I wasn't too. He still helps me with horses I still think about the things Tom would say. A very wise man, Tom. There's not hardly any clinicians out there today that have the insight that Tom had. They just can't read horses like Tom. One time, Tom told me it was good for me to work on ranches that kept you horseback because it might be more fulfilling for me than horse showing and clinics which of course is true. I think he liked those types of ranches that kept you horseback, not that many left actually. One of the most important things I learned from Tom is he would release a horse from pressure when the horse thought about it. When the mind's right, the feet follow. He knew when the mind was right. It was amazing to see, but to get the mind right, it might be all you had or it could be immeasurable and sometimes somewhere in between. The horses became soft and turned loose mentally, unafraid and willing. That's a very hard thing to learn at times and lots of horsemen don't know it. I believe Tom got his wisdom from his childhood and having to live with horses on his dad's place by himself a lot of the time. He ate, drank and slept with them. I'm sure at times horses weren't a business for him. They were his life and he lived it. He learned it almost by necessity. Not many people have a history like that. He was an amazing man. <sighs> so, thank you for joining me today. Keep tuning into the light and I look forward to see you next time.